30,000 acres of barren land. The Bonneville Salt Flats are known for one thing, speed. Just this week at Bonneville Speed Week, a new record was set at 448 miles an hour. As full-time RVers in a 30-foot Class A with a 125cc Yamaha scooter, we deployed our secret speed weapon. exceeded expectations. And I would say that not a lot of things exceed expectations because we research it so much online, we kind of know exactly what to expect. This is so very cool. We had so much fun just like driving around on the scooter, driving around in the RV. Uh, it was fun that my parents were here for this. And everyone out here is having a great time. Like cars are just kind of like whipping by, doing their own thing. People in, you know, just like four door vehicles are going way down that we can't even see anymore. Hey, a tip if you are planning on coming out here, so you're not camping out here on the salt flats. There is BLM right up here in these mountains, which is better because then you're protected a little bit. It was pretty windy last night. Um, but you're just, you're basically like right here at the entrance. Uh, so not, don't plan on camping on the salt flats, just nearby. A little random when you get out to the BLM outside the salt flats. A little confused on where to go. Whew. Fortunately, Campendium has exact GPS coordinates. Great spots. So not that you necessarily need to camp right in them, but it'll at least help you find the direction on which way to go down these dirt roads. Where you go up here? You go park up there. Oh, I see, yeah. Right, okay, so that's like one. Oh, yeah, because yeah, it turns out right there like that. that we didn't see anyone else here. We haven't been in a boondocking spot where we've really been the only people, so it was just funny that was my parents' first night in the RV with us, because my mom just kept being like, do 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 like no one else is here, this is creepy. Um, and then I said, no, you're gonna like this way better than when we're at the state park the rest of the weekend, and you know, like people are making noise and whatever. My parents have totally embraced RV life. They are off on the scooter exploring the salt flats right now, and we're gonna go meet them out there. soft flats on the bucket list and what I'm hoping to be <laughs> the very last day in the dry hot arid desert looking forward to what season three brings beautiful green lush mountainous areas with streams and rivers and beautiful views but my family here <laughs> is making fun of me because there will also be plenty of things to complain about in the mountains like mosquitoes and cold weather and rain and all those other great things that we'll find in the mountains. But you know what? Change is good. And we are ready for change, and hopefully you guys are too, right here on season three. <laughs>
she loves swimming. Well, Pepper, this has been a very stimulating interview with you. Thank you very much, and we'll see you next season. Okay, go back to sleep. It's okay. All right.